Hey guys, Aaron here for the Love of Tech. Welcome back to the channel. And today it is science class day here in the studio. And I have my phone soap pro, my Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra. And I want to demonstrate to you how dirty my phone is. Now I've taken this phone and I used it through phone soap 3.0 phone soap pro so i feel pretty confident it was clean then i went on a little vacation this weekend enjoyed some time at a pool took it in the water took it in the ocean fell in the sand so i'm quite certain my samsung galaxy s20 ultra is carrying all sorts of bacterias and things that could potentially make me and you sick and the whole point of this video other than algorithmic suicide according to the youtube algorithm is to demonstrate to you guys your phone is a dirty place to be you have it in your pocket you have it in your bag you have it on your table when you eat you have it everywhere and it's just getting grosser and grosser and you're doing nothing about it enters phone soap phone soap pro specifically so far my favorite of all the phone soap lines that i've had the pleasure of unboxing and reviewing for you guys this device here actually has the uv rays coming in two from the top and two from the bottom so it's bathing on all sides it's got this reflective coating on the inside so wherever the uv lights hit it reflects and it is just bathing our devices in this wonderful uv bacteria germ killing goodness so your samsung galaxy s20 ultra actually has the potential power to make you sick and no kids i am not talking about 5g i'm talking about bacteria germs infections disease sin malice retribution all of the fire and brimstone that you can take is coming and radiating off of my samsung galaxy s20 ultra and it's probably coming off of yours too. So what are we doing today? Like I said, today is science class day. Consider the following. Right, we're gonna do a couple different tests. I'm actually gonna do two complete tests and I'm going to let these cook in two completely different environments. So what we need to accomplish this, we have tape to seal it up. We've got a Sharpie so we can label and we know what's what. We've got some warm water we've got some cotton swabs we've got our agar agar gelatin like dishes see they're already pre-filled ready to go we have our gross samsung galaxy s20 ultra and we have our beautiful phone soap pro boom so without further ado let's get into the science project So this is our dirty S20 Ultra, and I'm actually going to do two dirty S20 Ultras. And the reason I'm going to do two of each is because I want to put these to incubate in two different heating environments to see which one is going to incubate faster or best one is going to be my backyard. I live in Florida, it's all the incubating that I need and also my garage, which is a little bit hotter than normal. So the whole goal, it's just to get the stuff to grow. So in order to do that, we're first gonna come over here and we're gonna soak up all the bacteria we can find. Let's get those buttons. Let's get the crack there. Now let's come back to the phone. Let's get down here by the mouth. Ooh, the mouthpiece. All the dirtiness is there. The earpiece, side to side. I mean, at this point, we're just spreading bacteria everywhere is what we're doing. 
S20 Ultra 1, S20 Ultra 2. Next, we're gonna go ahead and take the Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra and put it through the Phone So Pro. This is a five minute process, so don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. A few moments later. Welcome back. The Phone Soap Pro has done its job and it has completely bathed my Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra in this amazing, magnificent, ultraviolet, germ killing, bacteria defending goodness. And let me just point something out. So the phone still admittedly looks dirty. Clean and sanitary are two different things. That's what you need to realize. Clean is free of debris, marks, dirt, anything visible. Sanitary, sanitized, is when it is broken down on the molecular level and the germs and bacteria are free and you have released them into the wild, no longer to destroy you, your lives, your friends, your families, your loved ones. So the phone still appears dirty and I'm going to concede to that at the moment, but we're still going to coffee first. We're gonna take our swabs with warm water. We're going to wipe it all over the phone and then we're going to label this and then we're going to let it cook for as long as it's going to take in order to develop some bacteria. And then I'm gonna come back, restart the video and show you guys what I discovered. After, after, we'll be back after a few days. I'm back with a different shirt. Here are the agar, 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 about two days worth of growth, right? This is the first of potentially many experiments that are going to come out of the For the Love of Tech Science Kitchen. This is it under the glass. Look, oh my God, gosh, I'm, I'm almost embarrassed to show this to you because this is what I was holding, walking around with, putting in my pocket. Um, good thing is I am on a very rigorous hand washing schedule, so I do pay close attention to that. But here, let's just get a better look at this. This is the crap that literally started growing off of my phone. All I did was take a little hot water swab. I mean, gosh, look at some of those. You can actually see the texture and the bacteria forming. And this is one kind of bacteria here. Now over here, we've got another kind. I mean, it's just, we got some gobbly goop right here. I don't even know what this is. Oh my gosh, stuff is just popping up all over the place. So th this is disgusting. This is the uh, first swab. This is the second swab. I did two because it was my first time. I wanted to have a backup in case I broke it. And it almost looks like the second swab caught uh, a whole bunch of different kind of stuff. Maybe I... Uh, ran the cotton swab over an area that I didn't get the other one because this one here is different. And that one right there is also a little different from the other ones. So now let's go ahead and take a look and see what phone soap actually did. So this is the first after. So here it is. This is, this is what we got, right? This is what we started with and this is what we ended with started with, ended with. Let's go ahead and compare the second one. Before phone soap, after phone soap. So this one, oh, it's pretty bad. This one still got that big giant one growing there. So it looks like uh, a part of it actually got missed or I swabbed a spot that uh, didn't get cleaned. So. I do see why they say 99.9% .9 because as you can see, this is not 100%. There's still that big giant one there. Maybe even two phone soap cycles might alleviate that. So there you have it. You can visually see how dirty this one is compared to this one. So with that being said, let's go ahead and do a quick rundown, if you will. Now, right here, we have the Phone Soap 3.0. It has 
one light on top and the bottom. This is $79.95. This is the Phone Soap Go, which means it can go places with you and it does charge up. It has a battery in here and it will charge your device on the go and it will sanitize your phone without being plugged into the wall. And this is $99.95. This is the Phone Soap Wireless. What that means is it has a wireless charging pad in the middle, you get two UV lights on the bottom and one on the top. This one does need to be plugged in while you're using it at all times. Wireless doesn't mean it's wireless, it just charges wireless. That one is $99.95. This one is the one I love the most, not just because of the pretty, pretty blue color, but this is the Phone Soap Pro. This one is giving me a reflective coating on the inside with two UV lights on the top and the bottom. This is my go-to and it cleans within five minutes. The rest of these all clean within 10 minutes. Now what that tells me is I can still use 10 minutes. I can just do two cleaning cycles just to make sure I'm not missing anything. Because as we saw and as we learned, just because it goes through phone soap doesn't mean there's still not a couple little hitchhikers that you can do to get rid of. Guys, these are an amazing product. It will change your life. It will increase your well-being. It will give you peace of mind. It will protect you and your family. Head down to the description, click my link. There's a coupon code for you. In addition to that, every time you click and buy something from Phone Soap through that coupon code, you support the channel and I earn an itty bitty little bit of money and it allows me to keep buying these amazing products to share with you. For the love of tech, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think in the comments. I will respond to you, I absolutely promise. Till next time, for the love of tech, namaste.